All right, hello everyone. So today I will show you how to using uh Microsoft Excel to transform the uh, number grade into pass fail or into a letter grade. Okay, so this is very important task. Uh, sometimes if you have some uh, data mining task, for example, you have a, a numeric variable and you try to transform it into a uh, categorical variable. So uh, this is a very handy one. Um, so assume I have the uh, num numeric grade uh, with different uh, grade, uh, grade values in here. Uh, for example, the first student have the uh, grade is 69, 50, 70, and so on. Okay. So uh, now I want to uh, quickly to determine which student gonna be pass, which student gonna be fail. So um, the in order to doing that, I gonna using the uh, if function in uh, Microsoft Excel. So let's um, do with the uh, first uh, student if, and then I have the uh, logical test. So logical test, I gonna take the first value here. Uh, if that's greater or, or equal 60 uh, percent uh, uh, the student gonna be a pass uh, if not I gonna think this fail okay that's it um so you can see the first student uh, and I gotta select this one and I gonna hold down and kind of push all the way down to the end so now uh, the same function gonna be applied to this um, uh, great right here and so on so I can see that um, the first one gonna be pass second one fail um, pass 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 fail and so on okay so by doing that I can transform this numerical variable into a pass fail uh, categorical variable uh, but sometimes I want to know specific type of the grid uh, and in order to do that I gonna say uh, for example greater than 90 that's gonna A uh, greater or equal to 80 gonna be B greater or equal to uh, 70 gonna be C and greater or equal than uh, 60 gonna be D and uh, smaller than that gonna be a fail okay so um, we can do the same by using the uh, if uh, uh, nested uh, uh, if statement okay so this one and I can make a greater so this value right here greater or equal to 90 so um, I could have the the uh, value could be a, a else I can use the if the same value greater or equal than 80 uh, I can get the value of B and I can eat same value great or equal than 70 I can have the value of C and else I can have the greater than equal to 60 I can get the value of D else I can get a the value of F that's mean fail okay so that's it okay so by doing that I gonna see that this one gonna be D because greater than equals 60 and I can using the same thing we need that right here so I can see this guy fail this guy C, this guy B, this guy A, this guy fail, and so on. Okay, so or by using the nested uh, if statement, we also can um, transform the uh, numerical uh, numerical uh, grid into a letter grid uh, quickly. And it's pretty handy and so convenient if you have a large data set and uh, you can automatically. Uh, uh, apply the same formula to uh, different uh, um, student a different uh, row in the data set all right so i hope that helped and uh, please let me know if you have any comments and um, suggestions thank you i see you in the uh, another tutorial